What's good, stuff, King? It's your boy I'm Classy. You are now tuned in to the Village Reaction Channel on the tool. I need everyone to like, comment, subscribe, hit the bell notification so you're notified every time I drop a new video. Don't get punched in the face thinking I can just see This is what BMG looks like. You get big racks. You feel me? You already know. BMG got this city hot. And that's a fact. BMG got the city high. You want to shoot up a class like a school shooter? Better know my clip like a school And remember, we don't dislike you, but we might dislike you soon. And like I said in the last few videos, man, we building the Stella House. So if you want to support the Stella House and you want to send a donation, my cash app is on the screen right here. You send a, 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 a donation. You don't have to if you don't want to. But you feel me? Whoever sends a donation to building the Stella House, you know what's going on. Maybe we're going to give you a post notification. The house is already built, matter of fact. But we're going to modify the house, I should say. You feel me? It's kind of like building too, basically, because you gotta do a whole new construction, basically. But you know what I mean. We gon' we we gonna get this shit on some Stella Thomas. So if you wanna be a part of that, you know, tap in, send the cash out, whatever, you know, and I give you a post notification shout out. But today I'm gonna be reacting to D Thing featuring French Montana and T Dot. I got a feeling like this is a reaction I was being gonna do, but I just fell back and said, yeah, you know what? Let all the upcoming channels do their reactions first. You know what I'm saying? Let them get it out there. And then I'm going to tap in. You feel me? I'm going to tap in after. Because regardless, you know, <laughs> BMG to... Hold up. Can you put a crown on my head real quick? Let me let me go a little bit. I bet! I want my crown! A crown for a king. <laughs> Put a crown on my head real quick, editor. Put a motherfucking crown. You gotta put the sound effect too. Put a crown on my head with the sound effect. I got you, homie. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. I'm the motherfucking king of this New York reaction shit. So I had to let the little niggas get their little one-twos, you know what I'm saying? Now the king is here, nigga, motherfucker. Tap in with me, man. Shout out French Montana, though. I ain't gonna fuck up with tapping in French Montana since French since Mac B was out. Shout out French Montana. Let's see what he got to do, what he got to say on this one, though. Hey, niggas be sounding mad happy in jail, bro. Be the heart of this shit. Love you, muddy. Free that nigga for real, man. <laughs> he knows what's going on, King. Free you though. I love you. You heard me? I love you too, my dude. You know that shit, bro. Free that little nigga. I'll be tip. Cross that for a second. Yeah, watch that. She's in the sky. Never put over for my wife. Yeah, cops be everywhere. Yo, you know, y'all niggas notice something, bro. Whenever black people link up in numbers, the police is dead. And I know a lot of people going to be in the comment section saying, Yo, bro, but niggas be on gang activity. Niggas be... Blah, blah, blah. Shut the f*** up. Because sometimes black motherfuckers that be in gang be linking up and they don't be on no gang activity. They be really trying to chill. They just link up because it's bare homies and they just vibing. Doing what they do. You know what I'm saying? The police just be coming around because they know it's gang bangers and they hoping that they have... Weapons, drugs, and shit like that, warrants. No shit, Sherlock. You know what I'm saying? That's what they, they come around looking for. Like the police sometimes, they don't be, oh, yeah, it's a bunch of black dudes. They just chilling. Because they don't do that with Jewish niggas. They be Jewish motherfuckers, bro. Deep as fuck. You know what they thinking they had? Shit. It's like 50 Jewish niggas walking in a group and shit. But... They probably ain't got no warrants. I doubt they got guns on them. So now, you know what that is? Racial profiling. You know what I'm saying? Some of y'all gonna say, but bro, these people are known for this, and these people are known for that. What about the people who are known for being gangbangers that changed their life? 
Is it impossible to change your life? Come on, let's not run with that narrative that, oh, yeah, they've been locked up for this before, and they've been locked up for this. Get the f*** out of here, man. Get the f*** out of here. If you ain't you ain't been caught, real talk, that's how I think it should work with police. If you ain't been called to the scene for illegal activity, you shouldn't pull up. If you see a group of black men in the group, and, 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 and I don't give a f*** the numbers could be 100 people, bro. You shouldn't hop out and search them and do none of that shit unless you have probable cause. If you agree with me, comment on 100 emoji. Let's go. We take a trip to the ops trying to bury them niggas who diss on my block. No way who be setting up shots like it's okay for the low my knock. Bro, get a check when you showing out. Motherfuckers will be like, you see, he said all of this. But look what he said on the look. The upper class is defending these guys. Look what he said on the first line. I ain't gonna front. If you had a white, I right, put it like this: you had a white kid who's from the suburbs. That nigga don't. That nigga don't. That nigga don't got nothing to do with the hood. He don't know no drill songs or nothing like that. And he wanna make music. What do you think his music gonna be about? I right, for real. What do you think his music gonna be about? His music gonna be about what's going on in his vicinity. You know what I'm saying? Even, even if, let's say, he see motherfuckers riding around lawnmowers and shit like that. Because it's possible to make songs like that, right? Riding around lawnmowers and shit like that. He gonna make a song about motherfuckers riding around lawnmowers. He ain't gotta be a nigga with a lawnmower. He ain't driving around lawnmower. He just, that's what he see. He gonna make a song about it. That's the same thing with these kids. And then a lot of people gonna be saying, but they keep getting locked up for this and they keep getting locked up for that. Right? And I don't wanna seem like I'm making excuses for them, you feel me? But you gotta really think about it like this. Why do police carry guns? Police can literally walk around with batons and mace. Why do they carry guns? Because there are other people with guns who put their life in danger and they need to protect their life with equal force. America! Woo! That's the reason why niggas in the hood carry guns. Because it's other niggas trying to fucking shoot them. Not because they just want to carry guns. Like, think about it, bro. Oh, for you, for you cracking motherfuckers and you come in the comment section, you white cops, right? Oh, yeah, but why do they even have problems like this to carry guns? Why the fuck do y'all niggas be having problems and shit like that and your mother? And cop friend be covering up for you. You done knocked your wife's teeth out mad times and your cop friend covering up for you and shit, right? Let's not act like everybody don't have anger. You punch your wife's teeth out and then her brother come fuck you up now. You gonna shoot him and say, oh yeah, he came to my house and being aggressive. And you a cop and you get away with it, right? Bitch ass. Broke it a check when you showing that off. See why me they eat it, but move like a thought. Red flags, I be pulling a lot. Red flags, I be pulling a lot. Like, it's a good night. And the late smoking ops, it's a good night. Reminiscing how we took, boy, good life. You act right, I might put you on a good fly. It's a good night. Mm. Nigga said, You act right, I might put you on a good fly. So you saying, you sending, you sending tickets to the Trishas to pull up on you, bro? And the late smoking ops. Oh, are you saying, nah, he can't be. Talking about the ops, like putting the ops in the air, you know what I'm saying? Because if you act right, I'm going to put you on a good face. He talk about the bitches. Ops, it's a good life. Reminiscing how we took, boy, good life. You act right, I might put you on a good fly. Shit, smooch, you better not sweat up. Don't you know, wait till that I'm pussy get water. Uh. And she only going to cheat if you lie to your boyfriend about me. You got to do better. Don't you know, wait till that I'm pussy get water. Uh. And she only going to cheat if you lie to your boyfriend about me. You got to do better. Off first minute, set up my sweater. We ain't going, there was no letter. Off. I go front, though. When a nigga a real bum... And another nigga with money call him a bum to his bitch. That shit hit different. That shit breaks your heart.
look at the mug on my chest. That shit breaks your heart. <laughs> that shit break it, magic, bro. Like, think about it. Like, it breaks your heart, bro. Like, you think you it. And then that nigga pull up and some shit on your bitch. And, and, and like, yo, yeah, you nigga bum. <laughs> That shit hurts. If a nigga pull up on my... <laughs> Imagine me about I'm a, I'm a, I'm a, I'm a, I'm a hopping out the impact 2021. I think I'm lit. Nigga pull up next to me with double law <laughs> 2022. <laughs> Yo, shorty. Yeah, they go bum. <laughs> if he own his shit, though. If it's a rental, that nigga chat. Fuck that nigga, you feel me? He, that's his whip and he pull up. Boom. That shit go hit different. It's like, damn. <laughs> like, you want to go get a double R today? She like, she think you go to just get on some other shit. I go deep on her gut, she be screaming, she loving it. Mm -hmm. And promoters her book me, just know who I'm coming with. Mm -hmm. And we on a block like, so we in the club like. know who I'm coming with. My shot. Nah, he flowing on this shit. Free D thing, though. Man, free RPT. I ain't gonna front. I'm really fucking with these niggas. Like, I really rock with these niggas. You know what's crazy, bro? Let me show y'all niggas something. Y'all probably don't even know about this. You know what I'm saying? I ain't even gonna put the message on the screen. I just was thinking in my head that I should put the message on the screen. I ain't even gonna do it. It's crazy, cause D thing, right? I reacted to one of his tracks one time and I ain't like this shit and shit. And like, you know, I was clowning and shit like I normally do. So it hit me like he ain't like the way I reacted to the shit. Like he he didn't hit me on no like, yeah, yo, you a funny nigga shit. Like he hit me like, oh yo, I like I'm some like, hater shit. Or whoop, whoop, whoop and shit like that. You feel me? And I responded like, yo, y'all niggas, y'all little niggas be on some sensitive shit. Y'all got to cut that shit out or whatever. You feel me? But some probably, you know, caught himself. And, you know, he, he he didn't respond like a sucker. Like, oh, yeah, my fool, bro. Nothing, nothing like that and shit. But he caught himself and he, you know, he matched it out and made the better decision than a lot of these other dick Ryan rappers be doing and shit. And that's why I commend him. You know what I'm saying? Shout out to him for that. Not just because it's me in the situation with me, but it's just, it takes a different type of nigga to, you know, understand when he, 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 he made a the decision to correct itself, you know what I'm saying? And shout out to shout out to all these other niggas, you know what I mean? I was supposed to have T Dot on the podcast one time and it ain't happened. I had Bando in them and shit, but you know what I mean? Freedom niggas and you know what I mean? I wanna see them niggas come out and do their thing. Just know who I'm coming with. And we on a block like so we in a club like it's a good night. I'm trying to hear what Frenchie talk about. I'm a good fly. It's a good night. Woo 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 Bronx can't get no better. I told D, thank keep your head up. A roll max be that letter. New boo got it, that's Matt Black. Send it this song, go clap back. Hey yo, Frenchie, hey yo, Frenchie, if you see this shit right now, Frenchie, is is Max B coming home or what? Like real talk. Max B was coming home in 20, 2000, 2009. Max B was coming on 2012. Max B was supposed to come home like two years ago. What the fuck is going on? Is Max B coming home or not? Like real talk, Max B, yo, Max B definitely had, he definitely had the, the wave when he was out though. Like no funny shit, I used to be bumping Max B heavy. Stacks in the Gucci store, stacks in the Louis store, to the movies oh, why you bitch on the TV for the real? It get real wavy, right? That like oh, yo, y'all niggas, if you if you know, you know. 
Free that boy Max B. My son was waving for real, for real. I roll Max B that letter. New boo got it that's Matt Black. Send it this song, go clap back. I don't trust nobody that's that. Sunday service on my that's said? Matt Black. Go better. I told D, thank keep your head up. I roll Max B that letter. New boo got it that's Matt Black. Send it this song, go clap back. I don't trust nobody that's that. Sunday so service on my strap. Fit it first before soldier. We coming for the town, I told Nigga says Sunday service with my strap. Did his first no soldier. I go front. Soldier like, like real talk. I see why a soldier boy be saying he did it first though. Because real nigga shit. Imagine you create some shit, right? And then a nigga come out doing the shit. And they they like I right, put it like this. You see how Pop Smoke used to braid his head to the side? Niggas call this shit the Pop Smoke braids. Like, niggas wasn't braiding their head to the side before Pop Smoke came out. You know what I'm saying? Like, Tutu G's beads in his hair. Niggas was doing that before he came out. You know what I'm saying? Motherfuckers with blonde dreads, niggas that call this shit future dreads or some shit. And niggas was doing this shit before these niggas came out. You know what I'm saying? Like, imagine, though, like, like what the fuck? Like, nigga, Soldier Boy, he right for doing what he do. Like, nigga, I did it first. Like, if you really did it, like how Ray J said he killed Kim Kardashian shit first, I hit it, I hit it first. You got to let niggas know, nigga, I was first to do this shit. So now niggas can't call it somebody else shit. You get me? That's that. Sunday service on my strap. Did it first before soldier. We coming for the town, I told you. We don't fake beef for exposure. We stuck on the island with Doja. We don't fake beef for exposure. Real nigga shit. A lot of you niggas done had a whole lot of fake shenanigans for views. A lot of you niggas try to beef with me for, 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 for the views and the shenanigans too. Like, no funny shit. And then y'all niggas know who y'all are. All the niggas that beef to me though. Where them niggas at though? We coming for the town, I told you. We don't fake beef for exposure. We stuck on the island with Doja. Still throw parties when the op died. Still see red flags in her eyes. Pull up with your Julia Fox. Put that Who the f is that girl that friend she hugging up on like that? That better not be one of them RPG young girls. Frenchie? Coming for the town, I told you. We don't fake beef for exposure. We stuck on the island with Doja. Still throw parties when the op died. Still see red flags in her she got a nose on her though. I ain't gonna front. I can see her nose right here. She got a nose on her. Like, hold on. Hold on. Hold on. Hold on. Hold on. Hold on. I'm not. Still see red flags in her eyes. Damn. I can't pose it on her nose. <laughs> Charlie, she I see her nose. What the f? Yo, this shit blow my mind. What the f is going on here? Hold on. You don't need the music. There go her nose. She got a nose on her. I don't know if y'all can see this shit, but she a nosy bitch. No funny shit. Pull up with your Julia Fox. Put that boy on Fox 5. I broke Fergie to the block. Fought him for the stunt. Me and Schmirk before the deal. This ain't what you want. We got streets, niggas ain't me, niggas is fraud like all of my beats. Montana just went down. Snoopy just smoke streets, niggas ain't me, niggas is fraud like all of my beats. Montana. Niggas ain't me, niggas is fraud like all of my beats. Harry Fraud or Harry Mack? <laughs> Hello, who's the nigga that be making the beats? I'm tripping, man. I'm f up. Montana just went down. Snoopy just smoke, I be wild. It's Harry Mack. But it's just some shit that be. Man, f that. I know what you're talking about, though. She said, friend, she on some other shit. Oh, no, yeah, her nose is I done. Her nose is done. I see it. I be wild. She said, friend, she. That nose is done. Look at the nostril. That lip's done, too. That's some other shit, friend. She on some other shit. Oh, no, I got a hoodie. I, I call it a color name. She want to kick it, I told her I'm punting it. Let me slide by, Gang. and this is drive Gang, by. Gang, Gang, Gang. It's a good night. And the lay smoke and ops, it's a good life. Reminiscing how we took, boy, good life. You act right, I might put you on a good flight. It's a good night. 
and LA smoking ops. It's a good life. Reminiscing how we took, boy, good, good life. You act right, I might put you on a good flight. I told my niggas this day was gonna come. Now we up in LA, I done saw a couple bitches and bottles with a couple guns. Just in case these goofy niggas wanna front. Free deep that. Yo, I ain't gonna front. What's up with the cameraman, bro? Like, how you move off the bunda to straight niggas? Like, bro, we wanna see, like, go down. Like, go down. I done saw a couple bitches and bottles with a couple guns. Just in case these goofy right niggas wanna front. Free deep thing. Like, bro, we need Paul P.T. on the map. Bro, we could just be up on straps. My demon, we brothers like Cody and Zach. And the shoes that we can never lie. Moving daddy dressing on the black. Tell these rapper niggas, stop the cap just for you. We gon' roll a new op in a pot. And the shoes that we can never lie. Hold up, niggas got their moms doing the dance. Who moms is that? Is that that D thing moms? Kenzo, Kenzo and um Bando moms or that T dot moms? Who that moms? Who moms doing the dance? Tell these rapper niggas stop the cap just for you. We gon' roll a new up in a pot. Hey, hey, that probably Bando moms. Tell these rapper niggas stop the cap just for you. We gon' roll a new up in a pot. Like T dot you back in the field or some other shit. No Nigga, deep in my brother, you know who I'm coming with. Mm -hmm. Sister Jip, but you know that I've been on that gunner shit. On the block with the chop, like, like I know stun on house, like, yeah, yeah, yeah. it's a good night. And the lace smoke at house, it's a good life. Boy, good, good life. Good flight. Who's deep in the world? Nah, free D thing for real though. Like you see the thing about it, bro. Look at this shit. Look, like look at these niggas' situation. These niggas got so much love and support from wherever the f is they come from, right? That's that's this go out to a lot of rappers, not just D thing and them, but a lot of niggas got so much love and support from wherever the f it is they come from and shit like that. They hood support them and they back them, but then niggas end up in the most unfortunate situations like getting caught up and all that shit. Let me show y'all niggas something, right? <clears throat> Off the rip, when you talk certain shit, like you rap about certain shit, you go live about certain shit, the police is on niggas, you know what I'm saying? Y'all young niggas could do better, you know what I'm saying? But at the end of the day, y'all young niggas don't know better because of y'all situation, you feel me? So I give y'all the benefit of the doubt a lot of the time, so that's why people think I be sticking up for y'all. Because I think about it in a way I was thinking about life when I was doing dumb shit, you know what I'm saying? It wasn't really a thought process. It was the entertainment and the fun of everything. That's what I was thinking about. I wasn't thinking about, damn, if I get caught... They, this can happen to me and this I wasn't thinking like that because at those times in life your brain is not developed you don't understand life enough to make those decisions you feel me unless you learn from a young age maybe you go to juvie or you went through certain shit and you know better you know what I'm saying if you going through juvie and you coming on mad times doing all that shit and you still fucking up then it's a different story but a lot of niggas never went to juvie and none of that shit Feel me? And then even when you go to juvie sometimes, some people head are harder than other people heads. You know what I'm saying? Some niggas be, oh, we were to juvie shit. I was getting muffins and shit. I was cool. We had video games. You know what I'm saying? Not, you know what I'm saying? Like, some of you niggas going to run with that. But real nigga shit, though. You know what I mean? At the end of the day, my, I'm saying this to say, I'm saying that to say this, like, the situation that I have these kids put in, it ain't they fault. You got to blame shit on niggas' parents. Niggas' parents don't be working hard to get their kids out the hood. Some niggas' parents want to stay in the hood. You feel me? Because they thinking about themselves. They think about their ratchet ass friends and all that. And they, 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 they motherfucking all the clubs and all that shit. That's what they thinking about. So you got to blame their parents that these kids keep going to jail and going on. Nigga, nigga, at the end of the day, bro, you from a hood that's beefing with the hood up the block. It's rare that they going to see you. If you chill with these niggas from your block, it's rare that the niggas from up the block going to see you and let you rock. It's rare. So now you actually got to become a part of shit because now niggas seen you up the block and jumped you for no reason. You like, yo, I ain't even a part of this shit. Now you mad. 
People going to say, oh, but you can get mad. You should call the police. My nigga, if you really look at it nowadays, bro, you call the police. By the time police get there, you dead. You know what I'm saying? So niggas not in, in, in the vicinity, niggas growing up, and niggas not thinking about that. You know what I'm saying? And niggas got different morals, different values based on different places of, you know, growth. You know what I mean? But nevertheless, I get a song right here. I ain't going to front. D-Thing violated the hook. It's shit hard. That hook hard. I wish he was actually home to be individuals and all that shit. Turn it up a little bit more. You know what I'm saying? I get a shit nice look of, I give it a nice look of night. Nine. Nine. A nice look of nine. This track is hard. You know what I'm saying? First Montana, you could have did better. I ain't going to front. You did better on a WAP track. Huh? You could have did better. You know what I mean? But we know we know how you've been doing this shit for years, Frenchie. Shout out to Frenchie, though. Y'all niggas, like, comment, subscribe, hit the bell notification so you're notified every time I drop a new video. It's your boy, I'm class. If you not subscribed to Stella Gang yet, what you waiting for? Come on, join the squad, man. Stella Gang got the city hot. Hit that subscribe button. Hit that bell notification so you notified every time I drop a new video, man. BMG got the city hot. Y'all niggas know what's going on, man.